everybody. Welcome to a new episode of Beauty and the Beard Bedtime Stories. I'm the beard. I'm the beauty. She's the beauty. What are we reading tonight, Kate? Um, Green Donkey. Green Donkey? Yeah. What? This one. Oh, Little Green Donkey. By a name that's going to ruin me. <laughs> Little Green Donkey by Anuska Alipas. Alipas. A L L E P U Z. Little green donkey. <laughs> you excited about this? Yeah. All right, you want to cuddle? Go over here. I'm cold. Cold? We'll cover up. What well, we got? Quilts, man. Oh. Yeah. All right, you ready? Did you have a good day at school? Mm hmm. You sure? Yeah. Cool. Glad to hear it. That's what we like to hear. All right, little green donkey. It says, For my dad. Oh. Huh. I wonder if she. Read books with her dad. Think? Yeah. Is that, is that what you're going to do? You're going to grow up and write books? Yeah. You should. That'd be awesome. Yep. Yeah. This time, this is, this is the next one, and I think we already did 12, and I think this one is the 14. What? We already did 12 books, and I think this, books. and now, this number is going to be the 14. 14? I think this is episode 18. No. Yeah. No. We just... This episode like 20-something. I don't know. No, no, it is 40. It's 40? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> little Green Donkey. Hello there. I'm Little... I'm Little Donkey. And I love eating grass. Grass is my absolute favorite. A donkey just laying there in the grass. My mom is always trying to get me to eat other foods. Little donkey, please have a little tiny taste, she says. No thanks, I say. A, a life of eating grass is just fine for me. Donkey just eating his grass, just loving it. He's not going to stop eating it. He's not going to stop eating it. He's like you. He's always hungry. Grass is just so juicy. It's so zingy. So sweet and tangy. Flavory, fresh, and green. Is that the Ted? That's the donkey. Even my, even my pillow is made of grass. So that when I wake up, I can start eating right away. I really am the happiest little donkey when my tummy is full of grass. Mm. Oh, so, so it, I'm dead. Dad, I think that's the mom. No, it's the same donkey. He's just turning more green as he eats. So that after he eats all the grass, he's turning green down here. Does that make sense? And I think the mommy also eats that. Yeah. I mean, baby eats something. Usually it's because the mom did at one point. <laughs> grass makes me very full and very thirsty. Time for a drink of water. Ooh, ooh, grass, you are so green. In the sun, you have a sheen. I like to eat you day and night. Just give me one more juicy bite. He's like singing a song as he's eating the grass. Pretty cool. What has happened? Is that me? Am I green? He's looking down in the in the like lake or river and he's seeing his reflection. There's a pool. That's a what? A pool. A pool? Yeah. I don't think it's a pool. It is. I think it's a pond or a creek or something out in the wilderness. I don't think it's a pool. No, I think it is a creek. It's a creek? Yeah. Like Dawson's Creek? Yeah. Do you know what Dawson's Creek is? No. You're alright. Oh. My ears, my tummy, my arms, my legs, my tail, they're all green. I'm a gigantic herb. Now his whole body's green. <laughs> it's kind of cool. But like, his eyes are not green. His eyes are not green. His eyes are like a charcoal color. No, it's a brown. No, his eyes are brown. Brown? Yeah. Okay. Well, that works. Oh, no. My mom will find out that I've eaten too much grass. What can I do? Aha. Aha. This mud will hide the green, and these leaves will help, and nobody will ever guess. I'm a genius. So he's going to rub in the mud and turn brown and then roll around in some leaves so that they'll stick to the mud. And now he's just covered in leaves and mud and everything. So it kind of covers up the green a little bit. You think? 
Yeah. All right. Little donkey, you're all green, says Mom. You have finally eaten too much grass. And it's really time to try and eat some new foods. I bet you'll like them just as much as grass, she says. So Mama, Mama kind of confronted the donkey about eating a little more. Eating something that's not grass. Eating some, they eat some fruits or veggies or something. I'm not convinced there's any more delicious, anything more delicious than green. Burp. Oranges are, ju are too juicy. Pew pew. Watermelon's full of seeds. Um, broccoli is green too. Yuck. Apples? No, thank you. Who doesn't like apples? Grapes. <laughs> carrots. Hmm. Carrots are... Here's him trying all the different foods. Or maybe a hearse, right? I don't know if it's a him or her. So delicious. So orangey and crunchy and crispy. Amazingness. Mmm-mm. Carrots are my favorite. I'm gonna get, I hope he's not gonna be honest. Yeah. We like carrots now. So grass and carrots. Do you think it's because the carrots have a little bit of grass on the end of them? Yes. Think so? Yes. Okay. Carrots make me very full and very thirsty. Time for a drink of water. Carrots, you are so crunchy. Carrots make me feel so munchy. Carrots for you, carrots for me. Carrots, oh carrots, it's all I can see. <laughs> now he's orange. He's an orange donkey now. Yeah. Orange donkey. I wonder if he sounds like the donkey from Shrek. You think so? I think he sounds like a boy, so I think he's a boy. Sounds like a boy? Yeah. Carrots, oh carrots, all I can see. Great. <laughs> see his reflection in the water again, and now he's orange. Well, that didn't work out like it was planned. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. That's it. Yeah, that's it. So all that, and now he's orange. Mm. Great. I thought he was, um, you said day two. Is that great? That's a good story. I wonder if he sounds like a donkey from Shrek. You think so? What? That's what I'm hearing in my head now after reading the story. You and me can stay up late, swap manly stories, and in the morning, I make it waffles. <laughs> <laughs> I know, Dad's terrible. I'm sorry. So we like this book, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Well, that's it. That's our story. Oh, on the, back, on the back it says, for little donkey, nothing is more delicious than grass. He has grass for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yum. So that's what it says on the back. All right, Kate. Well, that was a good book. I'm going to high five it out. Boom. Is right. it time for me to go nope. to visit? Here, we gotta tell them goodbye, honey. Alright, say bye. Thanks for reading with us. Bye, thanks for reading with us. So we'll see you tomorrow. We will see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Of just keeping time, of hanging around in sleepy towns forever. Back road.